She was eight when we met and was about to turn nine. Just so little. <laughs> it was never uncomfortable with us. Like it was always just kind of like, oh, okay, this is who we picked, great, nice to meet you. Um, and then it just, like I said, there was never like that awkward or dull moment where we had to fill space. The thing we always talk about is like, she grew up, but so did I. I ended up meeting her and I was just like, gosh, she's so <laughs> like, I love her. And um, ever since then, like, I've always like, I've always looked up to her. I've always wanted to be her. Like, she has just been such an amazing, oh God. <laughs> she's been such an amazing person and an amazing role model in my life. So um, she has helped me in many ways that I cannot really say. Overall, my favorite memory um, is definitely um, us baking. I really remember that comfort day, so I love that day. Jamira is strong, energetic, <laughs> and driven. Definitely, she she knows what she wants. She doesn't always know how to get there but she will always ask for guidance if she's not sure. So my mom's a single mom. Um, and, I'm oh, sorry, my dad's not in my life either. So I'm kind of used to being like the one that, you know, put on a stroke suit and um, do everything for everyone around me. But I never know how to do it for myself because I'm trying to be so strong for everybody, but I don't know how to be strong for me. So anytime, you know, I'm having a bad day, she'll be there and she's like, I'm here for you. And you know, she's always consoled me and let me know, like, I'm not going anywhere. And I'm never used to people not going anywhere. I'm used to everyone, you know, just leaving. And I'm used to being abandoned. So I literally just, I love her so much. It's crazy. Like I have mad respect for her, like a lot. She's taught me everything that I know. And she's the first person like on my list. I'm like, I'm making her proud. Like I'm definitely gonna walk across that stage for my girl. Like, I owe it to her. Like.